Garçon, send me your finest frozen soups, please. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. It's that time of year again. The weather's getting colder. Even out here in Cali, kinda. Rhett, tell them the best way to warm up from the inside out. Oh, uh, you find the closest squirrel and you chase it until it surrenders. That'll warm you right up. Brett, tell them the second best way to warm up from the inside out. Oh, soup. I agree, but can we agree that the more expensive the soup, the better the soup? Let's find out. It's time for Naked Foods, Naked Soup Edition, Naked. Now, since we're trying to figure out whether or not price actually matters when it comes to soups, they have to stand on their own. So there's gonna be no fancy breads or oil or waiters with a pepper mill who wait until you say when to stop putting pepper on your stuff. That might sway our decisions. You get that? Everything is gonna be naked. Naked. We're gonna be trying to see some four different price points. Grocery store, that's either refrigerated or frozen. Fast casual restaurant, sit down restaurant, and fine dining establishments. Each round we're gonna pick our favorite soup. Then Stevie's gonna tell us what the soup is from and how much it costs, or where each soup is from, how much it costs. And yeah. by the end, we'll What's know this soup from? How, our exp how expensive our preferences are and which soups are worth their weight in gold hoops. <laughs> soups we're, and hoops, right. Yeah. We're wearing birds. This is chicken tortilla soup. Boy, and there is quite a spectrum here. Is this there one's not? this one's clear. This one's got green floaties. That one's cream. That one's thick and this one's sort of orange. Like somewhere in the middle. But this one looks like chili almost. Almost which, like I, chili. That that comes later. Hmm. That's a good not soup. good. <laughs> you don't like that? No. That's a good soup. It needs stuff oh, to make it better. You know what? But it just got watery at the end. Yeah, it's salty. I'm telling. It's not salty. Salty? It's not. It's nothing. It's nothing that I like. It's nothing that you like. This, what's this? Some called a puree? This seems more like a bisque. This is like one of them soups that they make in a blender. <laughs> okay. See now that has a taste. It tastes like tortilla. And I like it. It is better. The tortilla. Um, Should, I've shouldn't really... it taste like tortilla? I've never thought about chicken tortilla soup tasting like a tortilla. But that's got tortilla in it. How come this one is so different? This one's just got a bunch of floating individual things. Is What's it kind of cohesive? It kind of cohesive? This is something you eat when you're sick. Ew, it kind of makes me sick. I don't like that either. What um, is this again? Chicken tortilla soup. It, is it really? <laughs> I mean, that one is, but those aren't. This is definitely not. What is this? Where's the chicken tortilla? There's no enchilada sauce in that. What is this? And there's not in this one either. What is this? This is. This Hold is... on. This is like find the find the chicken. This is like a game. <laughs> See if you can get something in your lap. I'm a, I got it on my britches, but I didn't hit a duck. I don't want to drown a duck. <laughs> this, I like that cilantro. This tastes good, but it's just broth. There's no tort. The only one that has any tortilla is that one. Okay. Hold on. This is easy. I don't have to guess what anything is. I just have to say what I like, right? This one, going back to this one was kind of fun. <laughs> I don't need to go back anywhere. I'm ready. Go ahead. Three, two, one. Uh, <laughs> ultimately, you got to be careful with that, you know? I was. You remember that one time that you hurt me and I hurt you back? Okay, so you guys are um, agreeing do, yeah. here and what you're agreeing to is a three-way because you picked the fancy soup. Oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I feel like a professional wrestler. <laughs> you know how they just keep going like this? <laughs> oh my gosh. The arm, no. Mouchelle's arms don't bend that way. <sighs> Mouchelle, are you okay? <laughs> um, okay, that was a lovely fancy pants dance. That is from Polo Lounge and cost Polo Lounge? $22. The first Worth soup penny. is the grocery store soup from Target. It's good and gather for $4.49. The gross. And then the next one is our fast casual El Pollo Loco. Heard of it? For six ninety nine, and finally our sit down place, the Henry, 
for 12 buckaroos. Henry! Henry's saving money on ingredients. This is chili. Is chili a soup? A stew? Why like, wouldn't it be a soup? I've heard that there's people out there who say that chili's not a soup, but if you didn't know what chili was and you had this, you'd be like, it's a soup. Yeah, I mean, I, th I, th I think it. I mean, this is a thick daddy over here we're starting with, that's for sure. Lots of, seems to be meat. That's a nice taste. That's could, like a homemade chili. I was about of, to say, could be from a can. Um, <laughs> man, hold on, it's so weird. The, 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 the aftertaste is really, when you say, is it because you said can that I started tasting metallic stuff? Uh, I'm not in your head, man. I don't know. Oh, this one seems. I didn't think it was bad. This one's got other stuff in it, like chickpeas and carrots. Hmm. Hmm. Not enough salt. There's a complexity to this that I like. There's some heat to it. Um, but there's something about it that I don't like at the same time. Wow, really what is like it? It's like an aromatic yeah. spice that's like a little overpowering. Is throwing that, me. Is that saffron? <laughs> He's like, look at me, man. You think I you think a man with ducks on his shirt gonna tell you if there's saffron in there? Okay. Hmm. We're going to sweet town. It's weird. These are all stro strange. Stro strange. They're stro strange. It's 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 uh, got some sweetums. I don't like it. And this looks like that's hot dog chili, Hormel. How long are you? Just do a scrape, not a. <laughs> don't do that. For yeah, now. but look what happens when you do that. Just it goes do the down scrape. the side of the, and then it goes. Well, you didn't you didn't do a full scrape. See, I got I got nothing. That could be dog food. <laughs> There's no beans in it, and it is spicy. And spicy. Woo! Ha! <laughs> wow, that really opens you up and then uh, leaves you vulnerable. I feel like I could be, I don't know, shot by a hunter or something. I don't like any of them that much. Well, you can't like that one because it doesn't have beans. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't. Three, two, one. Ha! <laughs> you gotta hurt somebody, man. Yeah, listen, are you hurt? No. So I definitively did not like your choice. Did you I, make my choice? Um, I didn't like any of them, but I found this one to be the most interesting. And uh, I've had some good chili in my day, but it's been homemade every time is what yeah, I guess yeah, I'm yeah, learning. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so there is something interesting about the one that Rhett chose. It's our fast casual. It's Hanera, and also it's turkey chili. And the other ones aren't turkey chili. Uh, for seven sixty nine. Did not know that. And then Link, you chose our sit down place, Arts Delicat Delicatessen, <laughs> for eleven dollars. The other ones are grocery store, Home Chef from Ralph's for five ninety nine, and our fancy places at the end without the beans from the Arbor for fifteen bucks. The Arbor is going fifteen bucks, and they don't even throw beans in their chili. <laughs> Do you like the idea of spending some time alone with us? In plushy form? Because you can do that, uh, but you have to be a member of the Mythical Society, a third degree member of the Mythical Society. You need to sign up for third degree quarterly or annual by December 31st. Visit mythicalsociety.com for details. Good mythical morning. Snot mic up puffs. And there's plenty more where that came from. <clears throat> You made it weird when you said spend time alone with us. That was, get the plushy that was as much, by the end of the year. Point. Quarterly or annual plan, third degree. This is lobster bisque. This is lobster bisque. Okay. So we've got. The, the, you, you had a little Greensboro accent. Did on I? That one. No, you didn't. Oh. I was, I was, <laughs> you were like, D did I? <laughs> Both of these have the um, the uh, coloring of lobster. Of a chicken sauce. <laughs> yeah. And this one's darker. This one's the darkest. Now, I'm a bisque man. I like a good if, bisque. If lobster bisque is on the menu, I'll order it. Ooh, that is that very is coming really hard with the flavor. Creamy and lobstery. Man, wow, is it too much? It feels like it might be too much. Uh, I've never had a bisque that poignant. You've been bisked. <laughs> totally bisque, man. I love it. I mean, it's so much. Let me get a load of this, though. 
Now that's more what I expect. It's so sweet compared it's, to the other one. It's super buttery. Mm. Very buttery. Um, not cr not cream. It doesn't have a cream taste. It has a butter taste. That one has a cream taste. And this one, it, you're left with a nice lobster. Very high quality, in my opinion. Very high quality. Let's not acknowledge the fact now that we're on our something bowl of soup that we're just eating out of the same bowl with two different Listen, spoons. Man, our lives are so intertwined. It's. What a oh. boring embarrassment. Good. <laughs> it's, no, no, it's not boring. It's actively offensive. I just don't taste anything. I taste something, I am offended by that. I didn't find any lobster in there. It's been bisqued to pieces. <laughs> Compared to those two, this is, this is a sad place. And now we're gonna judge this one based on that one just because it's the same color. Now I see that you got a big chunk of something. Got a chunk of something. I'm looking, for, oh, I got a chunk, okay. Okay, that's the most straight lobstery one. This it's not. not it's not, it's easy, not too much of anything. Yeah, these. The, it comes down to these two here, and I already know. Stay reared back. Ugh. Oh. All right, it's definitive for me. After that. Three, two, one. Whip. Whip. Wham bam, wham bam. Link, why don't you get on up for a fancy pants dance, <laughs> sir? Uh, may I? <laughs> okay, it's over. <laughs> You chose the Morton's, Morton's Steakhouse Morton's, uh, Morton's. for sixteen fifty, and Rhett, you chose that's a mighty expensive bowl of soup. The sit-down restaurant Delmonico's for ten ninety-five. The good. one that you thought was terrible was our grocery store, Good and Gathered Target, for four forty-nine, really and the last one was Fast Casual Cousins main lobster, I was gonna say marine lobster, which does not sound good, for $8. Cousins, Cousins does a good, not bad. they've got a good lobster roll truck, and that, see, they let the lobster sing. I tell I'll, you, let I, that lobster sing. We see you, Cousins. Finally, we get to some differentiation. This is ramen. This is ramen. Look at that, now I like a good ramen. It's tough for two guys to eat out of the same ramen bowl. It's, it's tough, but it's not, okay, what's that? That's a pork. That's a pork piece. Allow me to introduce myself. I see you're doing that. To, well, I'm just gonna have you're to. Trying, I'm, I'm gonna just eat some I just wanted a separate. piece of this. Oh gosh, this is a strug. I am really struggling over here. I, I, I just want a piece. Oh, goodness. Oh. It's so far away. <laughs> But it was worth it. And then you gotta broth it. That was good. I didn't even get a nude. Um, Let me get a noodle. That's pretty good. This is, is it, if not, it's if gonna not, take a while. If not really good. I don't even think we should try this one. I mean, look at this crap. It can't be great. I love a good ramen. When it's cold and you're, you wanna warm up. Where's the broth, man? You wanna have a like a nice creamy hot broth. Make it spicy if you want. One time I had a sore throat and I was like, let's get ramen and let's make it spicy. And I thought I was gonna die. Like it hurt my throat so bad. This is an interesting one. Oh. How do you get to the... The pork and that is so good. It's Man. like shaved pork. But there's very little broth and it's not very creamy. Hmm. Pork is good in that. And this one's got all kinds of stuff going on over here. I'm sorry, I'm just dropping my noodle. I said, this pieces? is a noodle drop in here in the middle for me. I know, we're having so much trouble. Ramen is not a team sport. That's what I'm learning. Everybody should get their own ramen. Mm -hmm. yeah, oh, look at the size of that pork, Daddy. Take that off. Pull that, pull that off. Pull it here. apart? Okay. All right, this is a nice little taste. Hmm. 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 
All right. I think one of, oh, man. Can't tell, the brothy, broth, broth, broth time. Hold on. Three, two, one. Swabam! Yes, that one over there. That is a nice creamy broth. That is a nice noodly nude. And those, what is it called? Pork pieces pork, are just what? decadent. Just like, what's the name of the port that goes in it? But th these are respectable. Um, you guys have both chosen the fast casual place, R101 Ramen for 1245. What? Um, so not not the grocery store, which of course is the one next yeah. to it. Yeah, it's gotta it's be. Ling Ling from Walmart for 412. Don't do that. Ding and then <laughs> you can get yourself a dingling at Walmart. At Walmart. And then you the sure next dingling? one, that one that you're in right now is our fancy place, Iroha Sushi of Tokyo for $20. Iroha. And then the last one is Tamashi Ramen for $17.75, our sit-down place. The pork in this is exquisite. That's why I just continue to eat. Iroha got, has a really good um, crab soup, too, that will make you fart. <laughs> But it is worth it. That's a good spot. In the valley, y'all. In the valley. Okay. Super so Lake the, Ramen is my favorite. The lowest possible total here. from today's soup menu would be 1909, and the highest possible would be 7350. Rhett, your perfect soup meal total was 5309, and Link, your perfect soup meal total was 6195. Hey, you got more fancy, man. That's right, because, because I'm a soup boy. I guess. Yeah, I'm a fancy soup. He's a soup boy. All right, thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Kevin. And I'm Lindsay. And we're making homemade matzo ball soup for Hanukkah. Time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Happy Hanukkah, guys. Happy Hanukkah. They're going to put those in soup, Link. I love it. Click the top link to watch us figure out what soups were combined to create new soups in Good Mythical More. And we're gonna name them, so watch out. And to find out where the Will of Mythicality is gonna land. To get the Retin Link plushies, join Third Degree Quarterly or Annual by December 31st. Visit mythicalsociety.com for details.